She called me a liar. Well, not exactly, right? She said one of you is lying. Okay, look, I understand that you're upset. I'm just clarifying. She didn't actually call you a liar. She said someone is lying, and then she said the witness seemed credible. You do the math. Okay, I just think that we should drop it because I don't think there's any upside to splitting hairs about this. Okay. Look, I'm just surprised because it doesn't sound like something that my sister would do. Well, maybe not to you, but she is very intimidating. This is great. You know, we're about to get married and I'm just now finding out that you have a problem with my sister. Of course I have a problem with your sister. She's smart, she's confident, she's accomplished, she's ridiculously beautiful. She is every woman's basic nightmare. Do you think that you're every woman's basic nightmare? How could I be? Because as far as I'm concerned, you just described yourself. Ha ha. It's the truth. Jamie. You're still pissed. You think? I told you that I was sorry and that I was just trying to look out for you. And by doing so, you made me look like a scared little girl who can't defend herself. That's not true. Yes, it is. Two days ago, Erin thought that I was a liar. And now she thinks that I'm a liar and a wimp. I promise you, that was not my intention. Oh, I know that. So why do you think that you should go out there and you should fight fights for me without ever asking me? Because we're getting married and I love you and it's my job to look after you. Not like that. Here's the thing, I want to marry you more than anything and by doing so, I'm going to become a Reagan. But I don't want to become a Reagan. Does that make sense? No.